I got a new collector and I need to ship out this painting. So I gotta build a big ass shipping crate. Ready to build a crate? The first thing you need when building a crate, measurements, exact measurements. Get the size of the painting, and you're also going to need the dimensions of the padding too. This is industrial shipping foam. It's resistant to water, fungus, mold, uh, you buy it in big sheets. It's not cheap, but it is made to support fragile and heavy items long term. A tiny bit of squish, super strong, and <laughs> this is kind of silly, but I actually use a piece of this under my desk like one of those anti-fatigue mats, I don't know. Anyways, I get the foam from the same shipping supply company that I get my tubes from, and recently I opened a box with this note inside. I, won't thank you. I plan to double up the foam double up. all the way around because this is not a lightweight canvas. This is a six foot tall wood panel wrapped in canvas covered in clear epoxy resin. Basically this painting is heavy as two layers of foam. That's two inches. Now for the wood. On the sides of the crate, I'm going with 1x6 lumber. That's steep enough for structural supports behind the painting and plenty of room for the foam above the painting. And the painting itself is three inches thick. Damn boy, he's thick! <laughs> For the back of the box, I'm using this thin three layer plywood, basically just trying to save some weight where I can on this thing. This painting's already heavy enough. For the lid, one by fours all around on their side, 45 degree corners, same thin plywood backing. And once this lid is all screwed down, it's gonna make a lot more strength for the whole crate. And the best way to attach everything, glue, nails, and screws. This is actually the first time I've installed hinges on one of these. Yep. Definitely doing that from now on. Because it's so big, heavy, and awkward, I like to mount them directly on a skid pallet. This guarantees it won't tip or fall. Good and that the shipping company can easily pick it up and move it around safely. Mm-hmm.